We've gotten a lot of feedback from you guys about us talking more in our videos. Uh, a lot of us don't like talking to cameras. I bet a lot of you can relate. But we are working on it, so make sure you hit that subscribe button um, if you haven't already. It makes it worth it for us to get uncomfortable. So before we jump in the water, let me tell you a little bit about myself this time. I'm one of the mics that I had dead things. I'm the editor slash producer of the videos. My interest in fossil hunting began when I was a kid growing up in Kansas, believe it or not. Now there's really no way to tell you how I got into fossil hunting without talking about my companions on this trip. My parents. Back in the creationist period, when my parents were born, Kansas was actually covered in water. So as a kid, my parents would take me and my sister out to look for a shark's teeth. My greatest find as a child was this giant Tacotus tooth, a type of shell crushing shark that existed in the Creations period. My dad found this plesiosaurus paddle, which he ended up donating to the Sternberg Museum of Natural History. Today, all I have of that find is this sketch that was actually given to us. So, long story short, I met the love of my life, I moved to Florida, we had three kids, and it was several years until I realized that fossil hunting was pretty prevalent in Florida. So I dove back in, pun fully intended. And once a year, we're lucky enough to get my parents back down to Florida. Here's a clip from our first river hunt where my dad encounters his first Florida gator and naturally his instinct is to grab it out of the water, of course. Anyway, this year my mom and dad came down and uh, my dad and I decided to record some footage for some DIY sifters, uh, so look for that video to come out pretty soon. Also on this trip this year, I got to use my Nemo. It's a hookah dive device by Dive Blue, and for me it was a complete game changer. If you've ever dove rivers, you know just getting your dive gear and the tanks out there is pretty difficult. My gear with three tanks actually was 118 pounds without any weights included. A Nemo still allows for 10 feet of depth, but with three batteries, the weight is still only 13 pounds. That's 105 pounds less. Now, if you didn't notice, we have hats available. We've sold about 30 of these so far, um, all local pickup um, in Venice and in Cape Coral. But if you are interested in having one shipped, um, go ahead and reach out and I'll try to figure out what shipping would be for that hat. We've been selling them locally for $15 a piece, so whatever it costs to ship, we'll add it to the price. And thank you to those of you that have bought a hat and have subscribed. It means a lot. It's really helping us continue to move forward with this channel. Nemo, which my dad has now. I was able to tune down 
in a little deep pocket of water. And uh, within the first few seconds, I came up with a pretty big beat up Meg, but very unexpected. So now I'm gonna go try and catch back up with my parents and find a new spot.
Got a taper tooth. Sweet. <laughs> I think it's a nurse shark tooth. Yeah, it's broken a little on the end, but I'm pretty sure it's a nurse shark tooth. Yeah, I don't have one of those. And neither does he. Perfect. 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 Perfect.
Don't seem to 